I love that none of them are the least bit concerned about the fact that I was hucking weapons at the zombies and then just making them come back to me with the pure will of masochism. As we were just about out of petrol, we couldn't believe how lucky we were to finally find a safe haven. Interesting. So it gave us a recap of the main game. Also, I think they changed the native girl's name because I'm pretty sure her name was Yimmy. That, or that's just my idiotic pronunciation of it. Game, you okay? <laughs> Not sure why you gave a recap of the main game, though. They have a very high tolerance, Mr. Serpo. I've already administered three doses. So how much longer? You said we'd have results by now. Sir, this is uncharted territory. We'll need another day at least. Sorry, what? Just be careful. We don't want him dying on us. What about the native woman, Yeremar? That's a more complicated case. He's being taken to another location. Don't worry. I'm keeping a close eye. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, my head. Oh. Oh, what the hell happened? The motherfuckers drugged us. Who are you? Hey, we're talking to you. I'm nobody, really. You've been bitten. How long has it been? Long enough. I guess it doesn't affect me. So you immune too? So it seems. What? They plant you here to spy on us. <laughs> <laughs> right. That's one beat to shit like this. It's all part of my cover. So they tested you too? Yeah. I'm guessing they're trying to figure out why we're all immune to this. How'd you get here? I was a soldier before the shit hit the fan. Part of a huge humanitarian search and rescue operation. And then that civilian arrived. Serpo. Right. Suddenly, the military was no longer in charge, and the rescue operation was called off. So what are they up to? All I Bio know is there's a probably. around the entire archipelago. No one's allowed in or out. Whatever the fuck is going on, there's nothing to do with humanitarian efforts. That's pretty clear. Christ, I'm still woozy from these bloody drugs. Careful. Curious. Uh, damn, man, my head's killing me. Where's everybody else? They take him while I was out? Not quite sure. Can you... Oh, can you see straight? I mean, you're probably used to walking around drunk. Been to hell and back. Now I'm locked up in this ship. Fucking great. This is Colonel Hardy. The ship's been compromised. If you're down in the hold, I'm opening all the cell doors. Alright, gotta find a way out of here. Hope this tub has some life rafts. Hopefully. Also, what the fuck does he mean by compromise? That's not great. Um, as well... Curious, Serpo, I don't remember him. I only remember White, but... Maybe Serpo was mentioned some point or another. Well, actually, no, we never... We never learned anything about where the virus came... I mean, we learned little bits and bobs, but... As far as we could tell, the virus was just something from the natives. Oh, okay. So all I get is my skills. Huh. Those assholes were everywhere earlier. Now they're gone? Yeah. Apparently your friends are just straight up gone as well. Lovely. Are they your friends? Do we consider them our friends right now? Or is that a no-go? Okay, yeah, the ship is just shifting on its own. What does he mean by compromised? Like, are we sinking? Find a way to the second deck. Are we sinking, or has all the crew been turned into... Zombies. Well. 
I got my answer. Zombies. Great. And also, I'm kind of curious. How the fuck does some civilian fuckwit walk onto a military ship and say, I'm taking this over? <laughs> Unnecessary game. Like, I don't quite understand how that works. I don't understand why his control doesn't work either. There's gotta be something around here I can use as a weapon. And a weapon. So of course teaching us the basics, assuming we never played it before, per usual. No. Oh. I was about to say you got an upgrade on that flashlight, not gonna die on you anymore. Nope, nope, it's still a really, really like shit dollar store five buck flashlights. <sighs> I've never heard of a flashlight that does that. Everyone's dead, you moron. Yeah. Things have... Oh, lovely. Things have gone to complete shit. Equip a weapon. Yeah. yeah. What do we got here? Things have gone to shit, and absolutely no one's in control anymore. Because, of course not. This is the captain. If anyone's still alive, fall back to the bridge. Oh, great. Now the ship's blowing up. Oh, bloody... Now the ship's gonna sink. Perfect. Damn it! Is anyone even hearing this? If you are, the engines are on fire! Someone's gotta put them out or we're all fired! I hear oh, shit, you. I put out that fire. Oh, lovely. Oh, lovely. Yeah, I can hear you. I can tell what you're saying, but, uh, I don't quite know how. I'm not a fucking ship biologist. Oh, yep, yep, it's just straight up on fire. Great, great. I haven't seen a single zombie yet, and I'm already about to die. Yeah, where the hell is everyone? You idiots were trained soldiers. How the hell are y'all dead already? Come on. Cut off the flow. Okay, the way should be clear. Yeah, I'll take just as many if you stand in my way. Oh, lovely. For a zombie. Uh, Damn it. You're yep. already here. Yep, Walking Dead's alive. Getting old. <laughs> Fair enough. Also, I turned on damage indicators. Tell me how much damage I'm doing. I wonder if these guys are gonna be any tougher. Yeah. <laughs> ah, Okay, I survived the shit show somehow. Take that back. Which is kind of fun. Also, I feel like you guys should know that I'm stealing absolutely anything that's not bolted down. Which honestly isn't actually all that much on a ship. Come and think of it. No, oh, that was not me. It's some rocks, are you guys not controlling the damn thing? Okay, go. Lovely, just fucking Fuck you, you right? Not dying here. So, we're abandoning our friends then. Ow, ow. Okay, go. They can't climb ladders, they're too stupid to do that. Go, 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 go. Fuck, we're in the middle of a hurricane! Oh, you're joking? Was anyone paying attention? Ooh, guns. Like, right off the bat, guns. Okay. Mmm, that nearly knocked you back down. Come on, get off your ass.
Well, captain goes down with the ship, I guess. Guess that means the captain's dead. Yep. Gotta reach the bridge. Try and get this ship back under control. <laughs> I, I didn't hear what he said at the very end there, but I'm assuming it's something like, or maybe not. Did I have that in, did I have that in the freeze game? Technically, this is a different game. Melee. Huh. Well, I mean a melee with a gun. God, I can't see anything. Oh. Uh... I love how we're not even kind of concerned about our friends right now, but I guess at the moment we are not in a position to be concerned about anyone but ourselves. And do what? It said I could do something. Like an aerial strike or something like that. But I didn't quite get it to work. What's up? You gonna kill me? Oh, you! Stop! What about them? They're your problem now. You can't just leave them here. They're civilians. If I were you, I'd worry about your own survival, Colonel. Serpo! Of course, the rich millionaire decides Captain, to run away. Captain, come in. Captain's dead, soldier. Fuck! Oh, good. At least it's on an iceberg. Then we'd all be fucked. Oh, shit. We're on a collision course. We have to get to the bridge. Yeah, we got another problem. We got company. Where'd you get that rifle from? Aim for the exploders, guys. Tough to tell the difference between the soldiers and the zombies. Yep, come on, give me a triple. There we go, give me four. Ah, only a triple. There we go. bunch of my weaponry it doesn't really matter much right now that i'm throwing my weapons because honestly they don't really matter much they're like beginner weapons outside of the guns i'm not really concerned about them you know i really hope dead island 2 and i am playing this because i really want to play this before dead island 2 We're not. Um, but I did want to play this because of Dead Island 2. Gotcha. But one change I'm hoping they make with Dead Island 2, like they did with um, Dying Light, is I really hope they do remove the guns. Because guns, as fun as they can be in the video games, they've been so overpowered every time. It's hard to balance them. So much more fun when you actually had to fight your fights. Shit. Look at all these corpses. Oh, found the captain. Captain, my captain. What happened to you, captain? What the fuck was that, Logan? What? Your captain is absolutely capping my ass. So, uh, maybe not the time to be telling me to hurry the fuck up. I got bigger problems to deal with. Some point I lost my pistol. No clue when. <laughs> Concerned about the guns, he says. Doesn't even notice that he lost one of them. Oh god, Logan. 
Let's not start this shit. It's too early already. We drop the anchor. Oh, I'm not supposed to. I'm supposed to let you in. Gone worse. At least the ship still seems to be above the waterline. Chapter 1 Paradise. An achievement. Hey, hey, wake up. You alright? Oh, Jesus. What happened? The ship. Get up. The ship's dead in the water. Can you walk? I'll give it a shot. Where am I? Hal and I. But it's really not safe here on the beach. There's an infection. Some sort of plague. Seriously? <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me. The whole island's gone to hell. Out of the frying pan, into the goddamn fire. Yep. We'll talk later. Right now you need to move. Head for the Paradise Survival Camp. Look for the big treehouse. You'll find other survivors there. Take this. In the meantime, I'll see if anyone else washed up on the beach. Okay, um... I could come with you. Did I lose all my weaponry? This storm was a disaster. What in the bloody hell is this thing? I didn't pick this up. Jesus, what a mess. Yeah, what the hell? What is that? All sands. I have no clue what that means. Um I'm guessing that's because of the version of the game I bought? I didn't even have that in the base game. Let's see. And of course, they took everything from me, because why wouldn't they? They're not idiots. Oh, I have two points. Must have gotten a lot, a lot of XP. Still want this, and I don't know why I can't have it. Um, I wouldn't mind helping you out. You need to get patched up. I'm full health, lady. What the hell are you on about? I'm prop. Go to the I should I should I go back to the knuckles? Like I want. Okay. If you don't know, in the main series, it's dangerous here. You're safer back I had quite the affectionate relationship with a pair of brass knuckles that I outfitted to be quite the dangerous things. And one of the first bodies I loot after landing in the main portion of the game, the actual portions of the game, gave me a bloody brass knuckle. I'll take it as a sign from the gods that I'm supposed to use it. I'm not looting anything else. I got all I need. And whatever this thing is. This is just extra. <laughs> you know, for a place that's supposed to be safe, there's a lot of dead bodies along the way. To the camp. You mean the camp that seems to be under attack? I haven't even shown up yet and shit's already gone to hell. I will say this. Oh god, he survived with a dismembered arm. Normally they don't survive. God, you can dismember them and they'll still survive. Logan? Okay, uh, you know what? You made up for it. That was pretty awesome. But as well, the textures have apparently been upgraded in this version. Higher quality, which makes sense it was made later on in... Honestly, yeah, definitely. Going better. Where the hell is that? I don't even know what to call it. God. Okay, they have to be upgraded because of the fact that I imported a character. Because, for oh, sakes, do they hit. You know what? I'm in the middle of something. 
There we go. I throw out my weapons. That is the one bad thing about having a build that primarily revolves around me hucking my weapons and hoping they come flying back to me like a dollar store Mjolnir is the fact that I have to pick them up afterwards. You know, I'm kinda like a toddler, I don't really like picking up my toys. Except in this case, if you step on these toys, much like if you step on a Lego, it possibly could kill you. Yeah, I'm dead. I have died more times in the past, like, 40 minutes than I died in my entire freaking playthrough. <laughs> Actually, no, that's why the city was an absolute bitch. I died quite a bit. There we go. Enjoy. There we go. Those monsters nearly caught me. I'm assuming yeah. you're Trevor then? I heard from Harlow that you were coming. How does she have a radio? <laughs> and if so, what transmission do I tune into so I know where to look whenever I need something? That was I need close. to help you. I'm glad you made it. Thank you. Oh, thank God. Oh, Jesus. I thought we were goners. Where the hell did you come from? A military ship in an infected island? That piece island? of ship boat we were on sunk. You know, we need to talk about that bridge. It's funneling those things right to us. Mm-hmm. You're not telling me anything I don't know. The bridge is our bloody weak spot. Make it a kill box. We've got some fences. Maybe securing the other entrances will slow them down. But I need you to put them up. Can you lend a hand? Apparently so. Uh... Okay, interesting. So we're gonna get a weapon and it's gonna tell us about it. We're getting a nail gun. I think I might have just found my new favorite weapon. Please tell me I can nail these zombies to the wall. And I mean that literally. I'll do what I can. Uh, I appreciate it. Grab the rolled fences and put them up in the designated spots. Okay. Are you gonna give me the nail gun before or after? Wow, we are, uh, we're one hell of a handyman. I love that none of them are the least bit concerned about the fact that I was hucking weapons at the zombies and then just making them come back to me with the pure will of masochism. Thanks. You're welcome. Can you wait till I'm right up by you to talk to me? That was close. I'm glad you made it. If you keep saying that every time I walk by, I may cut your damn head off. We need to hold them back. To... Here they come. Oh, They're lovely. Holy shit! This douchebag is going down. Huh? That's um problematic. No oh, god, they breached everything. Sorry, Zoe. Trying to figure out who the hell the zombie is in this. Yeah. I love that as well. At times, I'm just ripping the zombies apart with my bare hands. There we go. Trevor, how are you Bloody doing? Hell, it was close. It's truth. I was hoping it wouldn't come to that, but they would have overrun us. Now the fences are working, but you were right about the bridge. We need to blow it. It's too dangerous. Take this flare gun and use it to ignite the barrels by the bridge. Flare gun? Also, did I get my other thing? You're giving me a flare gun? Straight up a flare gun. Uh, can I use it on zombies, perchance? I can just set zombies on fire now. <laughs> Love it. Got it! I mean, I damn near killed myself in the process, but it works. Oh 
Not quite. Guys. I'm getting beat to death here. Hey, the others survived. I heard the explosion. You blew the damn bridge? Was that really necessary? Kind of, oh, yes. Thank God you survived. Yeah, now I owe you something, motherfucker. Fair enough. Get up, you son of a bitch. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I owe you whoa. something, too. Apparently, you've all met. I know what it looks like, but I swear to God, I meant you no harm. That operation was out of my hands. It was Serpo. So who was he? Yeah, who he is works he? for a private concern. His superiors own my superiors, and they're the ones calling the shots. I'm sorry for what they did to you, but there's no way that he... What exactly are they doing here, Colonel? Bioweapons. The rumor is they're trying to weaponize this place yep. for use as a bioweapon. Being immune, my guess is your blood is essential for their research. You knew or this, their protection. you did nothing to stop them. I'm a soldier. I follow orders. Well, That's... soldier, here's an order for you. Go fuck yourself. Just listen to me. I can help you. There's a military outpost in Henderson, and I know the commanding officer. They have food, water, weapons, and a way up this bloody island. Last time we trusted the army, they threw us in a cage. Yeah. Look, I understand how you feel, but we don't have much time here. This island, it's about to be nuked. I'm sorry, what? Nuked? Yeah, we heard that same story on Benoit. Ain't no bombs fell there. Are you sure about that? This would explain all the air traffic recently. Choppers flying out with equipment crates. That's right. They have to cover up what they've done here. And once they're through evacuating the island... They're dropping a bomb? Listen, I trust this asshole about as far as I can throw him. But if what he's saying is true... We, we need to get out. off this goddamn island. Fuck me, man. So, Henderson it is then. If that's the case, then we're all coming with you. All right then. Let's move. Only five of us are immune, so some of us should stay and defend the camp while the rest scout for a way out of here. Good. Let's get to it. All right, Colonel. But if you're lying to us, God help you. Because we sure won't. Hmm. Fair. Hi. I would have a hard time trusting the army as well. Oh. You know, it's not the first time I've had the threat of a nuclear explosion coming down upon me. New survivors just joined your group. On the team screen, you can check who is... Hi, come here. What do you mean a new... Uh, how are you? Oh, shut the hell. <laughs> it's my... It's my freaking group. Okay. Weird. Oh, finally, you want to loan to- And I don't have a point. Lovely. Did I at least get my nail gun? You, you owe me a nail gun. I used to run a lighthouse, you know, before this, uh, this bloody mess started. Huh. If he spreads you're immune the islands, to nails. Everything will be gone. Oh, you're telling me that. We need to talk. Tell me that already. Um, I'm guessing you're the main mission then, because honestly, I don't really need to do side quests right now. I mean, if I find one that is interesting, I'll do it. But I'm level 30 something. What level am I? Level 34. I don't exactly need XP. I need weapons. Um. Come here. We need to talk. Oh. Okay, I'd follow you to the ends of the earth if you ask me to. What? You and Hardy don't like each other very much, do you? Not much, no. He threw my ass in the clink. I almost sank with that ship. Yeah. That's not gonna cause any problems for the rest of us, is it? Mm. We've got enough to worry about. Don't sweat me, understand? Now how do I get to Henderson? The jungle's flooded from the monsoons, so I think the only way is by the sea. Oh. One of the other guys here is from Halai, and he says it's a fishing village. They should still have boats. Once you get one of them, it shouldn't be hard to reach Henderson. When are you leaving? Oh, I can do that, but... Really? Again with the sea? Last time I tried using the sea to get somewhere, everything went wrong. It didn't take long. You Guess got we'll it. start. Good. The sooner you get to Henderson, the sooner we get out of here. As you can see, we each contribute to the team's safety and well-being with our own particular talents. 
If you bring us the right supplies, you can take advantage of our talents too. What kind of talents do you have? And where did she just... You saw that too, right? What? God damn it. Stuck on another island. Yeah, are you okay? Also, Just normally I don't see vision. you guys. This is definitely a step up. Um, I think I'm gonna end this episode off here. Like that. I would take literally anything. Okay, right now I'm gonna end this. Oh god, I need to take these headphones off or else I'm not gonna be able to bloody hear myself speak. Too many people. I'm gonna end this episode of Dead Island Riptide off here. This is gonna be fun. This is gonna be a lot of fun. I loved Dead Island. And not just because the videos and the shorts had a tendency to do better than my other works, but also just because I did enjoy it. I would lose myself for hours in Dead Island and not go really notice. It was easy for me to go an entire hour without noticing a damn minute of it pass. Uh, so yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm glad to be back in Dead Island. Uh, yeah, this series will be short. For reference, Dead Island was somewhere around 15 hours. It took, I think, around five, six episodes. Yeah, six episodes, I believe. This one is 12 hours. And as well, there's less, not necessarily less for me to do, but I already know a lot of what I'm doing. I already know how to do what I'm doing, so, you know, not quite as much to figure out. But yeah, right now, I'm gonna end this episode of Riptide off here. If you enjoyed, think about leaving a like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff. Alright, that, be good, be well, and I'll see all of you in the next one. Goodbye.